Hello viewers. Today we will discuss about how to add references in uh, a overleaf document or a latex document. Here is a thesis file of mine and you can see there are some uh, references added here but it is not till now added like a uh, real method and there is no reference here and we want to add those references and to show I have uh, I have collected that and written that references here this one is my first reference but um, in latex uh, it is not the method to write a reference just like one two and uh, this one I will show the right method so for this I need to copy this one and uh, I uh, need to add the references in bib file dot bib uh, in any of your latex document here is the bib file I have not till uh, added any of the reference you need to go Google Scholar Google Scholar it will come Google Scholar or you can simply type scholar.google.com I am writing the name of the paper and here is the paper and you can collect the citation by clicking here and here many formats are uh, given MLA, PA, Chicago, Harvard if I use uh, this type of citations or reference then I can copy this ones uh, directly but I want to use this in latex that's why we need to click on bib text I'm clicking on bib text and opening it in new text so this one is the big text of this now copy this one and uh, paste the big text here and you can name it like uh, r1 i have written here and when i have written this r1 till now it's not here when you cited them in somewhere in your text then it will be appeared there I will cite them here this is on my second chapter I want to go to chapter 2 and this one is chapter 2 dot text and here is one mention this is not a uh, rule of latex and press this and click cite okay this one site has come and now give that r1 i have given in my b file name on this r1 whatever you have written here you need to write it here to cite this one now recompile it and you will see the citation have been added let's see what happened okay here is the citation and uh, you can see if you hover it a uh, click icon has come and if you click on it you can directly go to that reference file and see here the first reference has been added I want to show you another thing and let's see I am searching my name I have also paper related uh, this thing let's see next one of my paper is Let's say I want to use this one, remote temperature sensing. So I am clicking here and I want to go to big text and this one is the big text and I am copying it and now I have to paste it in big file and this one is reference 
number i can write it maybe two one okay so this one is not listed here if i recompile it then it will not be listed here unless i have cited it so i want to cite it also in chapter two and let's see that one is a uh, robotics project i want to now I am setting that CIT E and second bracket and I have named that T1. You can see that is cross referenced and we are putting the full stop and I will be compiling it. Again, you can you will see the citation will appear and you can click to cross reference. And here you can see the citation is here. If another citation is here, you cannot click here. And this one is here. And uh, another interesting thing is that if you uh, add more and more like hundreds of citation that will be organized you don't need to mark it one or two it will be automatically organized in latex and if i'm clicking here it will take me to the citation it, this that's very interesting and this one is very tough to make in water okay thank you thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe to the channel